Disclaimer, all topics in this video are alleged and allegedly, and they are strictly for entertainment purposes only. Y'all interviewing us to be on point. It's Jay, though, what you doing? Okay, everybody, I do watch you. When you been doing your post about me, great job. <laughs> yeah, great job. I love you. Cool, tree. Wait a minute, you did your research, honey. I love it. Honey, if I need any information on myself, I need to come ask you, Jay Evans. <laughs> Jay Evans, you know exactly what to say. Yes. Hey, it's me, Jay Evans, the voice of the people, baby. And I'm here to give it to all my good people. In a minute, I'm going to roll into Kenya Moore's Instagram Live. Kenya says she ain't going nowhere. Now, she didn't specifically in detail address the rumors that are out there about her being suspended. Now, Kenya, a lot of people, Apple Pie was up in arms. They said you use this as an ad in promotion. Y'all see this. This lady said she scammed us into watching an ad. LOL. Now, somebody else said, Kenya, you know why we here. Stop playing with us. So, listen, we about to get into it. Now, Kenya even talked about her marriage a little bit. She said she is still legally married. That divorce isn't final. So, listen, y'all. Y'all tell me what y'all think after y'all watch this. Get in the comment section. Go ahead and subscribe if you're not. And we're going to take it away and hear from the lady of the hour, Kenya Summer Moore. You still daily, sis, so I got to say Kenya Summer more daily. Okay, Toro, go ahead and take it away, baby. Toro on it. Okay. I'll be any news until I get 100,000 viewers, so let's see if we're going to get that. Oh, my God, guys, before I forget, oh, my God, before I forget, I have to tell you guys, Megan the Stallion sent me the most incredible, incredible bouquet of flowers I've probably ever gotten in my life. Well, one of. But when I tell you she got everything right, she sent me a bottle of champagne, like top of the line champagne. Like she made a girl feel so special. So Megan the Stallion, I love you. Thank you so much for, for sending me these amazing flowers and just letting a girl know that you really appreciate her, meaning me. <laughs> and um, I love your music. I love your spirit. You are my Aquarius sister, and I just really appreciate um, appreciate the flowers. Like I was like, oh my god, I can't even lift them up the stairs. When I get home, I'll show you guys. But so I'm only at nine thousand views right now. So I'm gonna show you guys the spa until I get to a certain number, um, and hopefully my phone doesn't die. So I'm gonna give you guys a little tour of the Kenya Moore Hair Spa. Listen, we are now open for business, okay? We are inside the perimeter in Atlanta, um, technically Chambly, Georgia, um, but we're inside the perimeter, so it's considered, you know, greater Atlanta area. Um, we have seven um, chairs here. If you are not one of my apple pies, those are my subscribers. You better go ahead and subscribe. It's a billion, kajillion people here on YouTube, baby, and you might not come across me again. Be sure to set your notifications to all alerts so when I upload a new video, you'll get the alert. Feel free to comment below in the comment section and share. Let's get, get, get it. Um, for styling one is a private situation but i just wanted to like i know you guys have seen some images i know you've got you guys have um seen videos and some footage but i just want to show show y'all can y'all see can i get a little something to clean this um my phone my phone stays dirty uh hey angela oakley 34 love you girl <laughs> okay look so this is like the sitting area when you come in. It's so gorgeous. Over here, I got a product case here. Um, Monisha's here, thank you, honey. Mm -hmm. Monisha's here, one of my great stylists. She also, she also does my hair. How do you guys think my hair looks today? Of course, it's Kenya Moore Hair Care, yes. Um, thank you. Thank you so much. Um, Portia, <laughs> why y'all saying 100,000? <laughs> hey, Portia. <laughs> 
By the way, Portia, I'm so happy at our burgeoning friendship. Like, girl, you you are doing your thing. And I love, 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 love getting to know you on this level. It's, it's a beautiful thing. So, Portia, thank you for your support. Oh, my God. Okay, listen. I'm at the back. I'm winded. Okay, so this is my little office, everybody. Let me come in here. This is my office. Can y'all see? This is my little, my office. Can y'all see? Can y'all see? Yes. She has the executive view. Executive view, y'all. There we go. But I want y'all to see something. Hey, I want y'all to see something really special. I want y'all to see my head spot. Okay, so we're going up the stairs. Now, this is what I took the time to build. My second level. So I'm going up to the second level. Oh, let me show y'all this amazing bathroom. Now, remember when Portia was here, she really liked this bathroom. Let me show y'all. Ooh, ooh, ooh. The marble, honey, the, the marble. <laughs> so this is my second level. But I wanted to show you guys the head spot. So a lot of you guys don't know what a head spot is, but let me show you. So, I don't know. Can you see? Maybe I should turn it to the side. So this is the private room that, that is the head spa. So I don't know if you guys can see this bed, right? So what you do, you come in, you get like this robe that you put on. We have all new, all fresh. Get undressed, put this robe on. And of course, yes, the decor in here matches the decor downstairs, of course. There is... Um, let me show you. Can you see? Can y'all see the bed? So basically, Monisha, can you like, yeah, I think you can see. So you lay down on this bed, and I know you guys have seen this whole viral thing, but this is the selling point of this spot. You come in, Monisha will take care of you. She's the best. I love her. I'm not gonna get I'm not gonna get your face. No, she didn't wear makeup. Face. It's okay. No, so you lay down with all your stuff on, you can get comfy in the bed, you lay down, and oh this put this thing yeah, on. Here. Yeah. Okay, and so what happens is with this head spa, I'm on the thing. Yeah, that's what I'm you can't see me. It's okay. So you lay here and your hair comes down and you get this luxurious treatment in the head spa. Shampoo, massaging, water therapy, cleansing your scalp, detoxifying you, just giving you the most peaceful hour of your life. And it is so, so therapeutic. So I want you guys to know that this is available to anybody that wants to book time. It is the most perfect way to escape. So I'm here today because I literally need, you know, I need a little bit of, you know, TLC right now. Um, my daughter is is in, um, at, well, she's at our friend's house right now running around. And it's just a lot going on. <laughs> it's just a lot going on. But I wanted to tell you guys this place really is, this place is, you know, a part of, a part of my peace and a part of, me giving back to have people come and experience something if they're going through um, tough times in their life. A woman who just needs a break, a mother who needs um, some TLC, people who just need to reset. That's one of the reasons why I love being here and being at my spa because even though this is my first brick and mortar business, I'm gonna tell y'all, I'm gonna be so truthful right now and transparent. It has been so scary. Um, I know I'm an entrepreneur, I know I'm successful, I know I've done a lot of things in my life. But when I tell you this entire time, 
of building out this spa and getting, you know, even down to people like being haters and saying that the spa wasn't real or the spa, you know, was, you know, for show or anything like that. Um, it was totally ridiculous. So fighting the haters, fighting people that drive by and say, oh, the salon isn't open. We're open from Thursday to um, Thursday, Friday and Saturday. Um, you know, until we build up our clientele, I wanted to make sure that you guys had the most amazing experience. Um, thank you, Binge Worthy, Purple Hearts, if we want to see, um, you know, this beautiful salon. Um, listen, guys, um, this is an amazing uh, feat, and I'm just happy to be here uh, to allow you guys to experience it with me. A lot of you, Team Twirl, you guys have been riding with me. Uh, from the beginning of time, from, you know, from when I first appeared as, you know, Miss USA to, to being a real housewife and all of my many endeavors, my hair care line, shout out to Kenny Moore Hair Care and all of the above. You guys have been riding with me and I'd love you for it. So I wanted you to just have like this small tour um, and hopefully you'll come in and stop by because when I tell you um, <laughs> this place it's scary when you don't have a ton of customers or people are just looky loos you know. I've even had bloggers come and make fake appointments and cancel appointments at the last minute. Some of you might even know who those bloggers are. But the, the, the way that people go um, out of their way to try to disparage your name or ruin your business, I, I will never understand it. Like, I will never understand why you know, clickbait or using my name as clickbait. Hey, Latoya Forever, using clickbait um, and these tactics, you know, stalking me, um, you know, violating my privacy, all of those things. And yes, some of those things come with a job and I accept that, but not disparaging my business, you know, not coming out over here and, you know, literally calling, booking up my books, and then doing no shows because you wanted to see if, you know, we were open or you wanted to have a story, you know, for clickbait online. It's not cool. Um, leave me alone. <laughs> you know, I'm a single mom. I'm out here just like anybody else. Um, I am not getting child support. I'm not getting anything. I'm taking care of my daughter on my own, and I know a lot of you understand that. I'm an entrepreneur. So my endeavors, where, you know, I invest my money is always going to be in myself. And so far, so good. I have won at that game. But this salon has damn near, you know, broken the bank because I just never knew it could, you know, be this big on this scale. Um, and it's disheartening when you see people go out of their way to try to ruin your business. Like I've even had people on Google and doing Google reviews um, saying crazy stuff on Google reviews. So at the end of the day, I, I'm, I'm just like you. I am completely a single mom trying to take care of my child. I'm not getting support from my soon-to-be ex-husband because he's not. we're not divorced yet. Um, so, again, you just ride with me, you know. Uh, ride with me through this journey because I know a lot of entrepreneurs have the same journey of putting themselves, their money out on the line and not even knowing um, that if it's going to work out. Someone wrote, request a deposit. At this point, we, we, we're not taking deposits. We're taking full payments because of all the, the hate and crazy people. There's some people, maybe just Uber fans, that just want to get into the building. You know, that just want to get into the building um, just to either see me or see the place. So I wanted to share a little bit of that with you. Um, someone goes, the day in the divorce is lasting longer than the marriage. Yeah, that's true. It's been seven years. I got married seven years ago. My anniversary was just a few weeks, a few days ago. So that was, that. this has been a very, you know, very tough week for me. Um, having to answer a lot of questions, you know, from my daughter, having to to just deal with um, all of the stresses that, you know, just knowing that, you know, the marriage came to an end and I have this beautiful um, daughter as a result of that. So I can't say anything other than the fact that I am blessed. Um, and I just want people to stop uh, trying to tear down another black woman's business. Like, 
it's not that serious. You know, I think that I, I don't bother people unless they bother me. I'm over here trying to feed my family up to, um, I have a lot of responsibilities and I just don't need people just, you know, going out of their way to, to disparage my, you know, my good name. So, um, so yes, that's, that's what I wanted to share with you guys. Uh, I didn't get to a hundred thousand viewers, so I'm not sure <laughs> if I should spill the beans on anything else. Thank you. Someone writes, um, we want you to win. Um, I stay winning, you know, it, it is just, it is in my blood that everything, you know, success matriculates around me. Um, so I accept that God has given me that, but I also give back as much as I can possibly can. So, um, I give back to so many charities, so many girls just in, in my daily life, you know, my ministry, what I do to help other young girls that are going through tough, tough and difficult times. Um, I give back. So that's, that's just a part of who I, who I am. I don't have to broadcast that. Um, so again, um, thank you for for being a part of building this empire with me you will be seeing me i'm not going anywhere <laughs> uh despite all this stuff this surrounding um whatever this you know people decide that they want to write um thank you vaughn kenya's a winner what up though 313 i love you too superwoman the single mom thank you so much um thank you so much i appreciate it yes drew sador news period shout out to drew you know what drew has been amazing drew has been so amazing as a friend you know i love getting to know her um through you know this platform that i'm on and when i tell you Drew is doing her thing. So continue to support Drew. Continue to support all of my sisters in this game. Um, all of my sisters that are out here trying to do it for themselves. I love you, and I ain't going nowhere. So you guys are going to continue to support me, I hope. And um, somebody wrote, uh, let's see. Someone wrote, you're awesome. We knew we loved uh, her from the moment. Uh, yeah, it's just someone is writing, tell Drew I said never die alone. Okay, I don't know what that means, but I'll tell her. <laughs> Period, hearts. Anyway, I'm not going to take any more of your time. Thank you so much. Someone wrote, wrote uh, Kenya, you are a true hustling woman. I definitely hustle harder than anybody else. I'm from Detroit. What else can I do but hustle? Um... You, you, uh, someone wrote, wrote the Queen of Atlanta, Kenya Moore Hair Care, love you, Queen, thank you, future billionaire, I will take that, I will receive that, thank you so much, um, but yeah, thank you to all my sisters, the sisters that I work with, the sisters that are up and coming, thank you for being you, thank you for being transparent, thank you for supporting me, um, and listen, more to come. <laughs>